Despite what you might have heard, the Middle East can be a wonderful place to take a vacation. Many travelers are apprehensive about visiting this region. But quite a few nations in the region are considered not only safe to visit, but are full of unforgettable attractions and sights. Join Vucation as we present the best places to visit in the Middle East. Jordan this destination is generally considered to be the safest place for tourists to visit when traveling around the Middle East, although you probably should avoid the area that falls within two miles of the Syria and Iraq borders. In Jordan, you'll find Petra, which is considered to be one of the new seven wonders of the world. You can reach this highly photographed and treasured site by stepping through the narrow Sikh Valley. As you approach, you'll know you're getting close when you start seeing massive pillars gradually entering your field of view. Other notable highlights of a trip to Jordan include taking a float in the salty Dead Sea, scuba diving in the warm waters of Aqaba, and exploring the lowest altitude nature reserve in the world at Muji Biosphere Reserve. Qatar Ever since it was announced that Qatar was going to be hosting the 2022 FIFA World Cup, it has become increasingly noticed as a tourist destination. Here you can enjoy an authentic Arabian Nights experience, riding around on camels, exploring caves, and seeing ancient structures that will help you gain some perspective on world history. This country is considered to be safe, and it's also surrounded by the sea. You'll find a wealth of cultural attractions to take in, as well as the opportunity to enjoy all kinds of water sports like jet skiing and kite surfing. Qatar's capital, Doha, is quickly becoming a world-class city that offers innumerable cosmopolitan experiences. You'll find exceptional shops, restaurants, and luxury hotels. It's also home to the Museum of Islamic Art, which is jam-packed full of priceless artifacts and treasures that tell the tale of the Islamic world's relationship with art through a collection that spans 14 centuries of masterpieces. Dubai Dubai, located in the United Arab Emirates, is a wealthy and modern city home to the tallest building in the world, the Burj Khalifa, which stands at 2,716 feet high. It's arguably also the best shopping city on the planet. If you hop on the metro, you can make stops at all of Dubai's major malls. In the city's center, you can find a massive underwater zoo and aquarium where you can dive with stingrays and sharks. Every evening, the Dubai Fountain puts on a colorful nightly show that features water that erupts up to 460 feet in the air. The show is choreographed with music and lights and is well worth checking out. You can learn more about the UAE by visiting the Dubai Museum. Here, modern technology and history meet in a large underground fort that showcases the transition from village life to the modern industrial world. Oman this nation was recently listed as one of the safest Middle Eastern countries to travel to by the World Economic Forum. While it may be a relatively tiny nation, it's certainly beautiful. It dramatically extends out into the Sea of Oman, the Arabian Gulf, and the Arabian Sea. Oman is famous for its terraced orchards, ancient Aflaj oasis irrigation system, adobe fortresses, stream valleys, and traditional Arabian sailing ships. It's also known for its ornate mosques, meteorites, and Al Said, the world's third biggest yacht owned by the country's sultan. We recommend coming here if you're into diving. If you're a beginner, it's one of the best countries to get your certification. You can also take the opportunity to explore what's known as the Empty Quarter, the largest sand desert on the planet. Cyprus Cyprus is a European-Asian country in the Middle East. Although it hasn't always been considered safe for tourists to come to sea, today it boasts more than 2 million visitors annually. The people of Cyprus are known for being friendly and hospitable, and virtually everywhere you go, you can look forward to a warm and inviting atmosphere. The sun shines pretty much all year long, and when coupled with the breathtaking coastline and marvelous mountain scenery, Cyprus has plenty to offer for travelers from all walks of life. Scenic hikes can be found practically everywhere, and you can ski in the winter months while soaking in the phenomenal views of Mount Olympus, Cyprus's highest peak. Along the country's northern coast, you'll see some of the most beautiful golden beaches, as well as several deeply interesting ruins of medieval castles. When you're not taking in the sights, be sure to sample the delicious Cyprian cuisine, which has been described as a blend of Turkish, Middle Eastern, African, and Greek cuisines. Egypt 
While there has been quite a bit of socio-political unrest in this Middle Eastern nation, there is still a lot of magic to experience there. The primary bases for Nile Valley tourism, Aswan and Luxor, are very peaceful, developed, and well protected. The vast majority of popular tourist areas are far and removed from danger. There's nothing quite like finally seeing with your own two eyes what you've probably seen in photographs, the long snaking Nile and the mysterious pyramids. We recommend avoiding North Sinai, but the rest of the nation, including Alexandria, Cairo, Luxor, and Sharm el-Sheikh, is currently considered fairly safe to visit. Bahrain While it might be the smallest country by size in the Middle East, Bahrain still has plenty to offer. Travelers love how this nation provides the chance to experience a true Arab world without the strict application of Sharia law upon its non-Muslim minority. Though there may not be quite as many beaches as there are in other Gulf countries, visiting Al Dar Islands presents tourists with the option to enjoy a host of water sports, including sailing, swimming, jet skiing, and fishing. Bahrain's capital city, Manama, is wonderful to explore on foot. There you'll find many inviting cafes and shops that sell items like local crafts, tea, spices, sweets, and jewelry. If you're curious about the local history, you can follow the Heritage Trail to see places like the Bahrain National Museum, Bahrain Fort, and Al Kamis Mosque. The beautiful Al Arin Wildlife Park and Reserve is a must-see for all you animal lovers out there. You can see many species of plants, animals, and birds, including the Arabian leopard, the Arabian gazelle, and the oryx. Istanbul Istanbul is the capital of Turkey. It's a splendid destination, oozing with beauty in terms of architecture and art. Whether you're seeking adventure or a relaxing, leisurely trip, Turkey is one of the best countries in the Middle East to visit. As you explore Istanbul, you'll begin to understand its rich history while touring its many monuments and ancient sites. It's a city full of minarets. It's situated between two continents, Asia and Europe, and is basically an open-air museum where the past and present come together in a unique blend of diverse cultures. You can see Ottoman relics like mosques and opulent sultan's palaces that stand side by side with more modern monuments. It's also known for its many shopping opportunities. Riyadh The capital city of Saudi Arabia is delightful for business travelers and tourists alike. Riyadh offers a warm welcome to travelers of all sorts. It's a strikingly modern city with giant skyscrapers jutting out of the skyline. It's hard to believe that just a few centuries ago, this region was merely a small tribal area. Today, it's one of the top-notch cities on the continent. It's a convergence of modernization and tradition. There are plenty of historic points of interest to see, but it's also a place that boasts sophisticated modern buildings. A few of the best attractions include the Masmak Fort, the King Abdul Aziz Historical Center, the National Museum of Saudi Arabia, and Muraba Palace. Jerusalem Israel is one of the most remarkable places in the world to visit. Jerusalem, while lacking in the modern luxuries found in larger cities like Tel Aviv, is a place famous for being one of the top historical sites on the planet. It's an ancient city located on a plateau of the Judean Mountains right next door to the Dead Sea and Mediterranean. The city blends antiquity with modernity and is brimming with astounding religious and cultural marvels held dear to followers of Islam, Christianity, and Judaism. The city is a huge attraction for tourists from all over the globe. You can stroll around the old city to take in the majestic beauty, go shopping in its lively marketplaces, or let loose and enjoy its thrilling nightlife. Some of the best attractions include the Tower of David, the Dome of the Rock, the Jewish Quarter, the Mount of Olives, the Church of All Nations, the Western Wall, and the Temple Mount. Now it's time to hear from you. Have you ever been to the Middle East? Do you think you'll ever get there? Let us know in the comments section below.